Today, guys, thanks for coming to my YouTube channel. You heard me. It's your girl, aka Shlem, aka uh, bitch, aka big bitch energy, aka I really don't care. So, I am here today to give you guys a story time about how I played three niggas within a matter of 24 hours. And you know, it wasn't even on purpose. It's just like a duck is a duck, and if Scrooge McDuck bout that cluck, then I'm bout to pluck. <laughs> they should run me the coins run me all of them okay so i got invited on a date to um uh, was it chili's or fridays either way the cheap nigga spot the cheap nigga spot i got invited on a date to fridays okay so cool it was you know all cute and stuff you know he bought me there and you know i know he ain't really had it like that but i know he had a little something, something so i was like okay cool i was hungry so i was like fuck it i'm gonna go sit down i'm gonna shoot the shit i'm gonna you know yeah with the yeah so that happened we sat down homeboy was really playing like because i felt as though if you gonna waste my time don't waste my time at least let me order the most expensive thing on a you know the little dish or whatever so you know, he was kind of penny, penny watching and penny picking what I was getting at Friday's. Now, you know, we was at Copeland's, a Root Chris, or something else. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't have been upset. But you penny pinching at a fucking Friday's, bitch? What? Who does that? Wait, 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 wait. Broke men do that. Okay. Now, don't get me wrong. I'm not one of them females. I have my money to pay for my own. But... Why spend mine when I can spend yours? Disagree? Well, that's you, and I'm sorry. I'm going to keep playing these cats out like a sorry. <laughs> Words from the prophet, Lil' Kim. Continuing the story. So, homeboy went to the bathroom. And when he went to the bathroom, I went through his phone. So, you know what I'm saying? The dummy ain't had a lock on it. I was figuring, no, you know, I ain't care if he was messing with another female or whatever. Because at the end of the day, I was just there for a meal. Okay. Not a snack. And he was trying to make me get a snack. So, you know, I went through his phone to see if I could find, you know, something out that was going on. You know what I'm saying? To see if I could find some of the dirt on him. So, I was like, bitch, I want the fucking steak. Not the cheese sticks, bitch. So, I did what I had to do. And while I was going through his phone, I realized... <laughs> this nigga was really lame. Like, not normal lame. Like... I love you to a bitch I just met type lame. So, I realized the best thing I could do to get out of that situation was make a scene. Okay? Not a normal scene. A big scene. A huge scene. A massive scene. An epic scene. In the words of our president, the best scene the world has ever seen. <laughs> so, the wine came. The dessert came. My hand got a little heavy, just a little heavy, and it it kind of it kind of it kind of picked the it kind of picked the chocolate cake up just this much. Just get, it, yeah, don't fucking play with me. Don't ask me to come somewhere with you, okay? And then I pay for what you owe. What's wrong with you? Who does that? That's what's wrong with you boys. Y'all are city boys. Y'all are slum pinionaires. Okay. And I mean that. From the sincerest, lowest bottom of my heart. Now, all of this happened in a parish called Jefferson Parish. So, you know what I'm saying? I had to watch myself. But, you know, the white cops like little slim black girls. That's kind of cute like me. So, you know, I really didn't get off it too much but his wallet. <laughs> Which was fire because you know i got a little trade on the side too so you know i made a phone call while he was in the bathroom and homeboy was there to pick me up <laughs> immediately when i walked out <laughs> you know dude came to pick me up or whatever you know what i'm saying and i call so i got in you know these <laughs> one of my little dudes from like yeah like yeah from the get back so we ride you know what i'm saying i told him i said i want to go shopping so he was like was down with it. I was like, what you mean was down with it? He was like, 
was down with it. And I was like, oh, that was down with it. Okay. So, you know, I did what a thug missus had to do, you heard me? So then we, boom, we went to the boutique. Because I don't like shopping at normal spots, you heard me? I like shopping at, you know, fancy things where they only have fancy things that fancy things get. Because I'm a one-on-one. I'm a couture piece. So I only like couture pieces, okay? And <laughs> my specialty works, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> so we made it to the boutique or whatever i had all these clothes pretty clothes gorgeous clothes like clothes are so cute look i even have one of the pieces right here wait wait all right here look look at how cute and you know i still have not worn this bitch look at this look at this look at oh. god it's on brown skin we're gonna put this back oh oh shit okay so moving on so i got all these clothes he was like ignoring me because i mean he got money or whatever but like he wasn't paying me any attention like none at all and i hike he did not appreciate that shit so i was like okay since he don't want to pay me no attention or pay me no mind or whatever i guess i'm gonna just you know get all this nice ass expensive ass shit and tell homegirl at the checkout He's paying for it. He's paying for it all. All of it. All of it. The whole nine yards. I was like, he paying for all this. You know, he's on the phone talking to whatever, whatever business partners or whatever he got going on. So I was like, you know, he got this. We ain't stunting on this. He good. <laughs> he very <been> good. <laughs> I got his wallet too, though. <laughs> I got his car keys also. So boom. I take his nice little car. You know what I'm saying? I take the car to the park, okay? Because I said I was going to meet up with uh, my trainer. So, I meet up with my trainer. He's out there. He's like on some, you know, rah, 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 rah type shit. And I'm like, rah, 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 right back, bitch. I just need to make sure the bag is secured for the rest of the summer because I don't like to work. Okay. So, you know, I was told, like, it was, like, a get right for the summer program where it makes sure that everything is together. You know how to tackle them holes that's playing with your dude with the bag. You know how to drop down low to secure the bag. You know, we went through multiple, like, you know, the exercises to make sure we keep it right, keep it tight, keep it on sight, bitch. Don't mess with my nigga with the money, okay? Don't mess with the nigga with the bag or you gonna get had. Unless he got enough to show it, everybody and then you know it ain't so much of yet anyway 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 right back so boom did all that got through the training or whatever you know and then like at the end of the training i realized this was boring you know what i'm saying and i really didn't want to pray the trainer you know what i'm saying for teach me stuff that i like already knew I felt as though that was like a waste of my money and a waste of my time by taking that class. So like I ran off on the bill like nobody paying for that. I could learn how to do that watching a Cardi B a City Girl video. Fuck wrong with you. You know, after I took off running, you know what I'm saying? I got in the car, I took off, and now I'm sure I have, like, three different sets of dudes, like, after me trying to, like, you know, run down on a bitch. But it's cool, because I got them blacker, blacker, blackers, and rocker, rocker, rockers. I live in the South. It's okay. We got guns, bitch. And I think I've come to the conclusion that that was simple shit. I want to move on to something bigger. I want to move on to something cooler. You know, it was always my dream to be like a rapper bitch, singer bitch, actor bitch. And clearly, I acted my way out of getting arrested. So, I mean, I should be able to act my way out of everything else, right? Word on word, these dudes are lames. <sighs> Being a hot girl is fun until it gets boring. My advice to you girls, if you're going to aim, aim high. Don't settle for the guy that's going to take you to Fridays. Settle for the guy that's going to take you to Benihana's. Even though Drake talked about Benihana's, Benihana's is still way nicer than Chili's, bitch. Okay, bitch. Now, if you guys don't mind, I have some cleaning up to do. I have to go and talk to uh someone very important, like very 
important um about cleaning up some situations i got myself into so i love you thanks for tuning into my youtube channel bye bye <laughs>